month of October and we have a lot of binge worthy nights in our way. I think it has something to do with the weather. Don't forget to subscribe and hit on the bell icon as we create a simple yet stylish chocolate pudding. A dessert though sheer, sheer beautiful decadence. I'm going to finish all by myself. This pudding follows the principles of my sticky toffee pudding. So into a bowl goes in 150 grams of refined flour or go right ahead and use just one cup of refined flour. To that I'm adding two teaspoons of this gorgeous leavening agent that's the baking powder and half a teaspoon of salt. Into this we are going to add nearly two tablespoons of dark dark cocoa powder and about 100 grams of superfine sugar or castor sugar. Just mix it all together. Into another bowl goes in the wet ingredients. So one egg. We're just going to whisk this up lightly. Into this you add nearly 125 ml of milk and 50 grams of melted salted butter. Just whisk this well together. A slight well or dip in the center and I'm going to pour the wet emulsion right in. Just slightly mix it all up together. Though now very thick and dense, the accident in the end is going to make it one of the most moistest of puddings with a sauce right within. So as this has mixed up really well, we're just going to take a greased mold and the mold holds about a liter of pudding base in it. So that's perfect. We're just going to pour this in and smoothen it down. Smoothen it down and pat it with the back of your spoon so that you get it perfectly leveled within. No chocolate pudding is ever complete without a decadent chocolate sauce and what fun if the sauce is in the pudding. So 150 grams of dark brown sugar along with two tablespoons of cocoa powder, dark bitter cocoa powder going in. Just mix this up and we're going to scatter this right on top of the pudding. Sprinkle this right on top evenly. And that's the beauty about this creation where even a novice comes out looking like a real, real star. It's such a happy accident happening in your oven. And now inspired by my sticky toffee pudding, 375 ml of boiling hot water just goes right on top. Into a preheated oven this goes at 180 degrees Celsius for just about 40 minutes till the cake forms on top with that gooey luscious sauce below. Now imagine this balmy fall weather, slight rain and this decadent pudding ready to go right in. It's just natural to pair this binge-worthy creation either with some vanilla ice or indulge in some whipped cream. I hope you enjoyed creating this one with me, ingredients that we have readily available at home. Don't forget to share loads of love by hitting on the like button. Stay safe, stay blessed and don't forget to leave a note below.